You lot! Got a second! What's up, Bullyaris? It's the Commander. What's the Commander? Well, I haven't seen her for ages. Do you know where she is? Um, I don't think we've seen her. Are you sure? You haven't seen her at all. Think very carefully. She wouldn't hesitate to die for the colony if it came down to it. But she's so strong that she'll bear any burden alone, however heavy. Look, if anything would have happened to her, then... Colony 4, then... We... OK, OK. Calm down. Ugh. Sorry. Yeah. Yeah, don't worry about it. Look, if you see her, just tell me, OK? Sorry to have kept you. Yeah. Get ready to fight! It's you. What are you doing here? That's what I was. Wait! Look over there! Huh? Hear that? Was that a supply drop? Yes, sent from Agnes. How can you tell? We got word that an advanced troop from Agnes had been seen in the area. And if they're in the middle of enemy territory, it has to be due to some kind of operation. The supply drop must be timed for the arrival of a main force. Funnily enough, it's that supply drop we're after. Did you know about the Agnian troops, Tyon? I've known about the presence of Agnian forces in this region for a while. I could never verify that supplies were being dropped, but I won't say I didn't suspect. Oh, yeah? Well, looks like I can verify it now. From the way that you're talking, it sounds as though you're after supplies too. Well, medical supplies specifically. We thought Colony 4 might need them. I see. Then it looks as though we happen to have the same goal. Really? Boliaris was looking for you. You didn't actually come alone, did you? I actually did. Your understanding of the situation is correct. And I can't risk any more casualties. So you thought you'd go and take care of this yourself, huh? In that case, we... I said I couldn't afford any more casualties, and that includes you. I appreciate that you're willing, but Colony 4 is my responsibility. We want to work with you, Ethel. And be that as it may. We've already made our minds up. That's why we're here. You might end up having to cross swords with people from your own country. <sighs> Talking about avoiding casualties. You know that includes you too, Ethel, don't you? I yield. I can't very well refuse you now. Don't worry, Ethel. We're not who we used to be. Yeah, we won't drag you down. Then if we're agreed, let's hurry and pick up those supplies. Apologies, and thank you all. Head for the smoke 
rising from the container. That's our drop point. Roger, Dodger. Let's go pick it up before someone else does. Wait. Something's not right. Keep your guard up. Hey! Something's not right. What? What do we do? <gasps> no time to daydream. We have to hurry! <laughs> Ethel! You're right, Noah. We have no time to waste. Let's route those nuisances. Glad that's over. Yeah, just one thing left. Ethel. Huh. What? Take your wounded and get out. Huh. Leave, now. Did I do the right thing just now? As a Kvesi commander? There was never a reason for any of us to fight in the first place. You did the right thing, in my opinion. The actions you believe to be correct don't always lead to good outcomes. Some situations aren't salvageable. That's the nature of war. It's beyond anyone's control. Ethel? I'm sorry. <laughs> what a tedious thing to talk about. We'll recover the supplies and head back to Colony 4. I'm afraid I'll need you all a while longer. Hmm. <laughs> We find some medical supplies. Uni, let's get us some loot. Okay.
Hurry back to Colony 4. I bet Boliaris is crawling out of his skin with worry right about now. Commander? Commander! Commander Ethel! I looked for you everywhere. Where in blazes were you? I went to fetch medical supplies. Distribute them to the med team. Yes, ma'am, I'll... Uh, wait. No. Oh, no, no, you don't. I'm sorry for making you worry. Just... please. I did this for everyone. I understand your feelings, but... Ugh. Well, I suppose at least you're unharmed. That's twice you've helped me out. I owe you another one. Nah, don't worry about it. We were acting of our own free will. <laughs> then to reward your efforts, I'll work on getting our injured up and about again. Come, Boliaris. Uh, coming. Ethel. Hmm? What's wrong, Noah? I was thinking about what you said. The actions you believe to be correct don't always lead to good outcomes. Hmm. If someone like you says it, then I don't doubt it's probably true. But back then, you helped us. You saved us. You risked your life. Thanks to you, we're alive right now. I can say with certainty that's a good outcome. That's the only thing I'm certain of, actually. Noah, you... And we never properly thanked you. Ha, huh, so we didn't. Oh, yeah. Silvercoat Ethel, we want to formally thank you for your courage. <laughs> I can hardly recognize the three of you. I'll continue to do my best to live up to my nickname. Jobs are done. Time to hit the bus. You bet. <laughs> 